<laughs> Cardinal tradition. Mm -hmm. What is that to you? Oh, man. It's a focus organization. Um, hard work. Um, dedication. Discipline. And uh, just working hard and just being the best baseball player you can and the best teammate you can, the best team. I mean, it's just uh, it's it's a winning winning uh, tradition. You know, the guys come up, you know, from the minor leagues. These guys are pretty much ready to go. You know, and you don't really see that in a lot of organizations. You know, they come step right in and and they're ready to go. So it's almost like turnkey sometimes here. Defense has definitely changed throughout the years when you played to what it is now. Yet your team last year five Gold Gloves, two of them in the outfield. What's the difference? What makes them special? Talent, for one, and work ethic, two. And uh, these guys were good before they got here, man. <laughs> you know, it ain't nothing we done. Just, you know, the thing I think a, <clears throat> a good coach does is just just teaches them how to work. But with these guys, they bring the guys up so quick that they still learning the game. So the first couple years, these guys had to learn. They, you know, hitting. You know, they wanted to learn to hit, so you don't give them too much and. And once they got that, then they start opening up and wanting, you know, wanting to learn about different other areas. And with the coaches we have here, man, they got everything they need, you know. Plus, but it's good also that they, they love to work and they want to get better. They want to be the best they can be. And that makes it easy on us. But they go out there and put the work in every day. And it shows. You said with the information and the analytical information, how great is it for you that you've been able to be at the highest level as a player? succeed both defensively, offensively, and on the bases, mm -hmm. and now you can quantify that as well. Definitely so. I mean, uh, I basically do the outfield deal when uh, you got Pop and, and uh, Stubby and, and Skip that does the base running and stuff. So I'm kind of just an older, uh, wise kind of <clears throat> guy, you know, keep the guys going if I see something that I think from my bag of experience that I can give them positive. That's what I do, you know, but I stay kind of stay in my lane as far as like and deal with the outfield. And if somebody needs something, you know, about experience, uh, like what did you do here? Why did you, uh, when you got to this age, what did you do? You know, that's, I think that's where I think one of my strengths is as a veteran, you know, guy being able to play in the big leagues 18 years. I think I bring that to the table. But most of these guys here, Stubby, Pop, these guys have managed, you know, in the minor leagues for years. So, I mean, they know the game like up, up and down, so. If I'm a coach or a parent, and I want to teach my child to switch hit. What's the first thing that I should teach him to do when they have to hit from the other side? Get a T. Get a T. And just 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 fundamentals. And just fundamentals. I taught to, to, to tell you. I've seen guys when I started. You know, you, we had other guys do it, but they do it and they stop because they didn't have success right off. And uh, the first year, I was 19 years old in A ball, and I started doing it. But I I went home after rookie ball and I got a tee and I took hundreds and hundreds of swings left-handed. I figured I had four years. I act, actually, I counted all the swings almost that I had right-handed from little league on up to where I am now. And I figured I had to compress that in a four year period. You know what I'm saying? Mm -hmm. to, so I just got me a tee and I take 150, 200 swings a day you know, to get caught up. So the first year, I basically ran 250 in uh, Fort Lauderdale. Next year, you know, I had bone bruises, had pad on my, because they're pitching me in. So, all right, fine, give me a few infield hits, go home, get stronger. Get stronger next year, made double A, then got sent back down to A ball, hit 318. Went home, got stronger, and just kept getting better. Kept, kept the same work ethic, kept the same amount of swings, and it got to the point to where I was a, a, a better hitter left-handed as far as contact and stuff goes, but more natural right-handed. I didn't have to do as much right-handed. I had more power. Okay. Now, quick one answers right here uh -oh. when I give you names. Nolan Arenado. Oh, unbelievable. Awesome. Goldschmidt. One of the greatest I've ever seen. That's not one word, around. man. That's I not one word. I know. I can't. It's hard. <laughs> <laughs> okay. <laughs> Great. <laughs> <laughs> Some things don't never change. No, they don't. <laughs> Even with a microphone. <laughs> Molina. Oh. Mm. Uh. oh wow. Mm. Mm. Oh wow. I, Is that the, the word wow? 
Yeah, I, I mean, it is because I have to say more, man. I, ha I can't explain it in one word because I play with a lot of great Cardinals and this guy amplifies Cardinal baseball, competitiveness, uh, willingness to win, unselfishness, team player, and great player. He, he just wants to win, man. It's, it's uh, one of the greatest, like I say, greatest Cardinals I've ever been around, if not the greatest besides Ozzy. I mean, I'm just saying, you know, all around, you know, what he brings to the table. It's just about coming here, coming to work, wanting to win a game, however he can. Albert. Ooh. One of the greatest ever. I mean. And you don't, you don't know how to follow I, rules. I do, I do not, man. I can't. I can't. I don't think that way, man. <laughs> I'm my own man. <laughs> so, uh, I, it's, a, it's just great to have him around, man. I mean, it's this guy, I, you can already see the benefits of these younger guys. I mean, how he's going to help guys like Yepes. You know, he's talking to him. And for them to have opportunity to talk to him like that, man, I mean, just watching him, how he goes about his business. He hits ground balls. He still runs hard, man. I mean, it's just, these guys are just winners, man. Winners. That's all I need to hear. All right. <laughs> Thanks for watching ESPN on YouTube. For live streaming sports and premium content, subscribe to ESPN+. Plus.